And I think on this particular session, they're doing a lot of love songs. Uh, I love you so much and faded love and those kind of things. And I had a lunch break, so I went up to the studio. And when you came into the back of the studio, you came by the control room before the artist actually sent you. And I stopped and said hello to Owen or something. And, and he told me he wanted me to leave. And, and I just walked in and I didn't know I'd done anything wrong yet. And uh, he said, did you and Patsy have a argument or something before you got here tonight, or before she got here? And I said, no, I don't think so. He said, well, every song she's crying. and said, I don't want you to break the mood. He said, get out of here. As I look at the letters that you wrote to me, it's you that I am thinking of. She falls into that category of, uh, of, a, of genius or near genius, that when Patsy Cline sang a song that had been completely sung, and there's no way to improve on it, no way to do it different. She could take a song like uh, Faded Love that had been done forever by Bob Wills. Well, you thought of the song as a Bob Wills song. Bob wrote it, he recorded it. When Patsy Cline recorded it, it became a Patsy Cline song. Patsy had the talent, uh, she had the voice. Uh, oh my goodness, uh, all she had to do was just sing anybody's song and, and uh, their records quit selling and hers start selling, you know, it's just, she had that type of voice. She sang completely from within her heart, out through her vocal cords, to the people. And there was no translation in there, it was Patsy coming out. And that's why she put that stamp, that Patsy Klein stamp, on everything that she did. After the session, we all went up to Owen Bradley's office to listen to the recording, to the to the playbacks, and um, uh, we were all s sitting around totally enthralled, and I remember she, oh, when it came to that first, that uh, certain part in Faded Love where she just went went down and, and her voice just kind of kind of quivered and went back, the emotion, gosh, and she'd say, play that one again, play that one again, and play that part again, and they'd keep running back to that part, and she was so happy and so thrilled with it. You listen to... Uh some of those records and you get to the end of uh, Faded Love and uh, where she does that little sigh like that, you know, and uh, you could tell it was really for real. <laughs>